phone because I really don't want to pull on my camera right now. Got home. Boots came in. The boots came in for Mr. Drake. Kind of scared. Y'all know I'm short, so like, what if the boots are just like weird length? You know what I mean? Got it for a pretty little thing. I was gonna get them on Amazon because they literally have the exact same ones on Amazon, but it's like a six and a half, and my feet are generally huge. And Pretty Little Thing had a size five, so it was Pretty Little Thing. And they were on sale too for like 30% off. The locks got a little. After a little trouble. Stop. Stop. I didn't think I was gonna really like these that much. I'm not a big like stiletto girl. They're kind of cute. Okay, I'm gonna try them on. Okay, literally did not mind my outfit. We're just here for the boots. What do y'all think? I like him. I'm not mad. I feel like it just looks weird right now because of my outfit, obviously. Just wait for the whole fit, okay? Actually, pretty good, like, length. Like, it's not too high above my knees. Hey, guys. On my phone again. Checked the crib to see if they had the skirt that I wanted. When I checked, it was out of stock. Emailed them to ask them when they're going to do restock, and they told me they really don't have a set date. So then I just randomly looked, and the skirt was in stock. About to open her up, and I'm about to try her on, and I hope... I hope it fits because I got a size small. It's kind of hard for me to like pick sizes nowadays. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah. Stop. Got a size small because the model in the picture was wearing a size small. But y'all, it's looking a little big like on my waist. Y'all see that? Should I return it and get an extra small? But what if the extra small is too small? Let's get it tailored. Sad. I should have... I should just got both sizes. I should just got both sizes. No, I should have just done that. Hello, you guys. My forehead looks big as fuck. Damn! <laughs> Anyways, you guys know we're going to Drake real soon in literally two weeks. So many upcoming appointments. So excited to like become a baddie for this, okay? Now I am about to go to this tailor place. Hopefully get the skirt tailored because as you guys know i kind of didn't like how the skirt fitted not bad but i like my clothes more fitted I yesterday to see if i could come in today around noon I hope 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 she can get the skirt done by the time i need it done because if not i might just have to thug it out and wear it <laughs> got here i went inside and she was working with someone so i was waiting and she asked me what did I need done and I pulled out the skirt and she was literally like no we can't do it Said something about like she doesn't have the machine for it or whatever Then I go to another tailor place and see if they could do it I don't feel like bringing my big ass camera in right now Got here and it looks kind of sketchy You said she can't do it either she told me to go to the mall next to the movie theater I'm gonna go check that out in there and i really didn't know where it was and i get there and it's freaking closed and but online it says it's open I even called uh, the number and she was like um is the lights on i'm like no and the gate is closed and she was like okay let me call real quick called this one place see if they can get it tailored i called them and i asked them hey i need the skirt tailored like the waist is a little big but it's leather and i asked them if they do leather and they're like it just depends on what type of leather it is if it's like a more thicker leather then maybe not come in and see if they could do it if not i'm just gonna say fuck it looked online to see if the skirt's in stock and it's not in stock i really i just knew i should have got an extra small look at me now i'm stressed stressed update on that she couldn't do it either because i needed it done by the 25th and she said that it would take longer than two weeks she said almost three weeks um so yeah no today is the first appointment of the prepping for the drake concert <laughs> today i have my facial and i'm really really excited because like i'm not like consistent with my facial get a facial and then like i'll go back in like the next two months I feel like i really do need a facial like my white heads and black heads this do y'all see that that's disgusting i also booked for a derma plane too so i have a couple packages that i need to open that i got for drake basically have my whole outfit for drake except for accessories i need to get earrings and like maybe a necklace i'm planning on doing all silver but other than that i really have everything that i need and you guys seen it i got the packages in the mail i opened them for y'all i ended up getting like an extra shirt from white fox just in case because you never know like in case outfits is a need oh fox is so bougie like 
this little like halter top little corset type of deal cute they have stars at the bottom and i got it in a size small so hopefully it fit from pretty little thing got a little bag the context that you can't bring in big bags and that said like it could be like a small bag or clear bag Duh, this is so cute and small. It also comes with a chain. So cute. And then I believe this is the dye for the shirt that I got. Black dye little kit because the shirt that I got, it's tan. And I got it from the crib. They did have a black one, but I don't know where it went. It's like not on the website anymore. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm going to just buy the tan one and then buy some black fabric dye and then just dye myself DIY it okay that's everything that I got I just got here you guys it feels so freaking nice outside like it's 73 right now but it feels so good because we literally had a heat wave it was in the 90s last week and oh my gosh I was dying I gotta put you guys on my tripod <laughs> actually it looks so freaking good <laughs> it looks so good just got home mina told me to put a uh, pimple patches on when i got home skin looks and feels so good but i'm gonna put some of this clean and clear Persa gel 10 on so good for acne you guys like especially for like an incoming pimple this is so good to use yeah my skin looks so freaking good and she was even telling me like the texture of my skin has gotten so much better and i honestly think it's because of the toners i've been using my nail appointment on monday so i'll see y'all when i see y'all i just got done with my workout i literally just took a shower at the la fitness i've never took a shower like actually at the gym but i kind of had to because it's the only way that i'm gonna make it to my nail appointment this shirt from amazon the, the sleeves are looking big so they're kind of like falling a little bit and they should have bought so it's gonna have to do somewhat blow dry my hair somewhat dry guys why are old ladies so fucking rude i put my stuff in one of the lockers a white okay sorry but she was white a white old lady literally got the locker right, right on top of me right stuff was kind of in the way so like she was walking and i kind of went in front of her like i didn't mean to like i didn't mean to and she was like well excuse me what i said to her i said just trying to move my stuff for you like the fuck like that is rude as hell so freaking excited for my note point today i'm doing something different real 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 different gonna put some super glow screen because i'm not doing my makeup got here i'm waiting for the come in cue surprise we're doing some stilettos i really like that black scent I like this one, uh -huh. so I like that. I'm gonna replace this with, with this. Yeah, we can do that. And I like this one right here. Like the star kind of? Uh huh. So you want star? Yeah. Maybe we could do that on pinky. Just 
coming together. Yes. I kind of wanted to do a 3D. Do you have a 3D picture or you want me to like do it? I'm just going to put my crush in there and then... Yeah, we're going to put it together. Okay. Yep. Like we always do. Okay. What's new? Back to the store. Tea time! <laughs> Yeah, she bought me oh, big period. one. Period. You have all the sizes. It's perfect. French on the middle. I was and little stars. On this one star. On and I was thinking doing the 3D on this. On this one. Okay, I'll let you do that. And then the thumb. I was thinking. Look, this one's cute. Oh yeah. Okay, let's do that. Styling on me right now. We're going crazy. <laughs> it's not too clear, but like, you know. Yeah, that's pretty. Okay. See? Two design I'm thinking, right? So I want to do kind of like that, right? Cute. But oh, this yeah. all. Speed it up though. Ain't nobody gonna watch this. This ain't no nail tutorial. <laughs> I don't think we sleep in there. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not slick. Yeah, I'm be watching it for real. Real fan, watch it through. Don't break the dangle down, okay? <laughs> look at it, look at the thumb. <laughs> oh, this is bad lighting, but... No. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Oh my god, this is fire. That one's good. Like, like you can hear it. Can you hear the dangle? There you go. If you don't hear it, it's not cool. <laughs> You're never wearing this. No, I'm never again. <laughs> Actually, ask Oh my god, I know. There's a cuticle oil. You probably won't see your hand and know it's your hand. Really? No, it's, it's the ring. Your fan literally is flying up. Is this a real hand? Girl, you know damn whether it is her hand. Got done with my nails. I'm gonna get his reaction. But I'm gonna show y'all first. Damn, I'm gonna put the flashlight on that bit. <laughs> yeah, she's so. Hey, on, look, the know. little dangly star. Yeah, that's Drake vibes for sure. Eh. Okay, guys, I am on the way to my lash appointment. I'm actually going to uh, lash with Anne. I used to go to her all the time. And it's like my number one lash tech like her retention her isolation like everything is just so good when it comes to Anne. and i just feel like she's really like just one of the top lash techs here in washington I actually booked for a freestyle set i just really want her to do what is best for my eye shape it's got done i love it time to break the bank hate that sound sometimes out of my lash appointment so we decided to go with more of like a cat eye so the longest length is 18 it's like a wispy cat eye if you guys can't tell you guys know i love my wispies i'm about to get my eyebrows threaded i haven't got my eyebrows threaded in a while so i'm kind of scared i always get scared to get my eyebrows done i'm always scared that they're gonna be too thin but then they always end up looking really good after i get my eyebrows done i need to go to the mall because i still need to get black lacy bra brows are done oh my gosh they look so good i just love the feeling of like getting your eyebrows done and them looking literally snatched okay honestly this is the only one they have 
to come to the mall right by my house because the one in Tacoma, the pink literally didn't have like any like good cute lacy bras. Victoria's Secret right now. I think you maybe that one. Shout out to my itty bitty titty community out there because I feel free guys. You have a lacy one. The worst store in America, y'all, is officially Ulta. Don't know why the fuck they will make this store like. Who the fuck wants this type of nail nail fucking glitter? Glitter or whatever that shit's called. Like, ain't nobody coming to the store for that. Jeez. Every time I get up in this store, bro, I'll get hot and sweaty. I think I showed you guys the shirt. I don't even think I recorded me opening the shirt. This is the shirt. It is from the crypt as well. First look on the crypt, they actually did have a black one. Like went to go look again. It was like the black one was nowhere to be found. So I was like, let's get the tan and buy some black fabric that I bought. That's just smart, right? Try to do this and I'm praying it works. And if this doesn't work, I don't have another top option because the other shirt that I got from Fox kind of like a lot going on with the skirt and like the, if I were to wear the tops. I don't have anything to really put it in except for this little like BFFR. What did that spell? B fucking for real. Plastic container. It's big as fuck, but it's the only thing that I have. This little a die kit on Amazon. The concert is literally tomorrow. I'm doing this so last minute. This is the jet black dye with some glitter stay. I'm guessing this is like to actually make the black stay. Word instructions. You can do it on a stove top. <coughs> Something in my throat. Wearing rubber gloves, prepare the dye bath. What is in my throat? Shit. Are you good? Like, are you good? I need some water. Hold on. Back. A cup of vinegar dye bath for nylon, silk, or wool. I'm pretty sure this is wool. Let's say the type of fabric it is. Fuck it, huh? I'm just gonna do whatever I feel like is gonna be good. Consistently for 30 minutes or until desired color is achieved. Up to 60 minutes. Damn, you think I'm gonna be starting for 60 minutes? The fuck? gonna do me honestly I don't know how I'm gonna put water in here this might not work okay yeah this is not gonna work oh man this is gonna take a while all the water in I'm just gonna put my gloves on shake well This is pour one half of it. I'm just pour all of it. Like I'm not gonna use it ever again. Oh, it looks like squid ink. It literally. I'm just use the whole thing. Fuck it. Is it just mix? Okay, I feel like it's not gonna be like as jet black as I want it. I'll say just my like soak in here overnight. Good morning. My fucking day. We're gonna go see Drake. I'm so excited. My hair done today. It will be installed and yes, I don't care what no one got to say. I'm gonna comment something negative, just keep it to yourself. Woke up this morning, I put the color stay into the bucket. With got the shower. I got this freaking cute ass two piece from Amazon and it is so freaking comfortable. Make some greens because I don't want to be bloated today. Craving bedia tacos for ease. I didn't know like what was the bedia tacos because it said face of bedia, but then like it said not tacos. Getting some bedia ramen, so freaking good. Damn, this is good. some extra. I like mine sour. Yeah, anyways, I'm gonna eat and then I'm also straightening up my room right now because it's Friday and I like always like to straighten up my room before the weekend. Head out to my hair appointment right now. So ugly out right now, but it's not like too cold. It rained last night, but it's supposed to get like in the 80s around one. Starbucks because the pumpkin spice is out, and I'm not really a big fan of pumpkin spice, but I'm kind of feeling like I'm on a pumpkin spice latte right now. I actually asked a girl if she wanted something from Starbucks, so she has some replied. I kind of want to try the apple crisp, but I never tried that before. I can see it in your eyes, you're angry. A grande ice apple crisp oatmeal shake and espresso. Thank you 
so much for this because I've never had this before. I was gonna get freaking pumpkin spice. Oh, it's kind of strong. It's very strong, actually. On the way to get my hair did. I just got here. She literally just replied to my text, like literally right when I was pulling up, asking if I was still at Starbucks. And I said, Sorry, girl, I already left, but I am here. Oh, no way. Hi. but here's the hair it's a 28 inch and then she did my edges was gonna get a scar for like something to wrap my edges on while i was getting ready but i didn't have time so i'm kind of in a rush right now just laid out my eyebrows and primed using the elf pal grip the niacinamide primer the other day i went to sephora and i got the mario makeup by mario real skin foundation I wanted to try this today. That's what we're gonna do. I got shade 140. I said it in the in Sephora, but I don't like I really hope it doesn't like oxidize or try real hard to get this on my edges. See, like I've seen the reviews for this. No, I don't remember if they said like it was if it was light or like medium or full coverage. Mm, I don't like the smell. It smells like pink. Okay, color match. Being like medium coverage, but I feel like it's very sheer as well. I'm gonna try not to apply that much product to my forehead. My hair did kind of take longer than I wanted it to, so that's why I'm kind of in a rush. But it looks so good, like she really did her thing. I'm gonna go ahead and put her Instagram on the screen if you ever want to get a wig installed. And she also does makeup as well. The coverage is actually pretty nice. I'm gonna go in with my fancy little contour stick. I love this stuff, it's so creamy. I'm freaking so excited for today. Like, I've literally been waiting for this since I fucking bought tickets. And the day is finally here, and bro, I didn't even know he was having a show on Saturday, too. I'm also gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury contour wand just to be a little bit more snatched. You can hear, but like, I love the way my nail sounds. When I'm doing my makeup, I don't know if you guys can hear because the AC, but like, it sounds like I have like a charm bracelet on. I don't know why it's so satisfied to hear that. When I was getting my nails done, Vanilli was telling me how she like took her recent Instagram pictures on Canon G7X, the camera that I used to vlog on. It just looks so freaking good, like with flash and everything. So I'm gonna try to take some pictures with that camera tonight i'm literally charging the battery but like the thing about it is like the screen is broken that's why i got a whole new camera i went to ulta yesterday and i got some new bead blenders because i wanted my makeup to look good and i just wanted some new beauty blenders because i don't know i just feel like every time you use a new brand new beauty blender like your makeup just looks 10 times better honestly it doesn't even take me that long to get ready anymore like i swear it only takes me like 20 minutes. I will literally get ready in 10 minutes if I wanted to. If I wanted to, but I'm trying to like go fast, but like take my time too, because I need my makeup to slay today. Okay. Honestly, really want to do like a get ready on here and then a little get ready like music in the background on my TikTok. But my phone needs to charge, because best believe I'm gonna have a full battery when I get there. I can't do both at the same time, especially if I'm rushing. So freaking Huda Beauty Cherry Blossom Loose Powder, like I love it too big, because this really like brightens my under eyes. It brightens my under eyes way more than like translucent powder. Makeup is a dumb a new hangover, Too Faced Hangover for three one. You guys know this is literally my go to. I feel like it makes my makeup like less like cakey and like more smooth. Honestly, the shirt, like, it didn't turn out black, black. It's more like gray, but I guess that's fine because it's, like, I'm going for the silver black. Some silver accessories because I'm not going to be wearing gold. So these little silver earrings. These silver earrings. This little chunky chain. So cute. Okay, guys, this is the final look with the jewelry and everything. This is baby's fit. On shirt, you see it? Jubilees. But yeah, we're all ready to go. Man, it's crazy, man. It feels so crazy. Getting ready. It was five years ago with you and me.
don't get to come to Seattle much, so I'm definitely going to make the most of it tonight. I'll tell you that. Okay guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I absolutely loved how this video turned out with all the edits and everything. Um, I was going to put more of him performing at the end, but I really don't want to risk getting copyrighted because it's Drake. Like, come on. It's Drake. I'm pretty sure I'll get copyrighted off like three seconds of a song. So, yeah, just know that the concert was so freaking fun. If I could have, I literally would have went to his Saturday show as well. And he played Girls Need Love for his surprise song on Saturday, which I'm really fucking upset about. Really upset about, Drake. You could have played that for us on Friday on your first tour date in Seattle. Anyways, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I know I've been really, really lacking and just been really inconsistent with posting lately. And there's obviously reasons why I just haven't been posting. But when I'm ready to talk about that, I'll be ready to. But, yeah, I'm going to try to grind out all the rest of the year for you guys. Um, so, yeah, I love you guys so, so much. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure to turn on your post notification to be aware when I post a new video. Bye.